And in other news, Chief Justice Martha Kome now says corruption, insecurity and budgetary cuts for the judiciary remain the biggest obstacle to judiciary's independence. Speaking on Monday during a breakfast meeting with the heads of the mission at the annual Development Partners Roundtable, Kome cited the security of judicial officers as paramount for the effective discharge of duties. The President of the Supreme Court urged continued support from development partners. The mission is far from complete. Our resource budget condition remains dire, and your continued support would be invaluable in order for us to realize the full objectives of our transformation agenda. We appreciate your support. Uh, with those uh, brief remarks, it's now my pleasure to invite the Honorable the Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya and the President of the Supreme Court of Kenya to make her remarks. Because of those insecurities, we have had to pull down the makeshift courts which we had, like at Makandara Court, we had to pull down the tents, and therefore now we are short of courts where we can discharge justice. Uh, we are in a state where judges are being threatened, they are being stalked, their security is being withdrawn, and that keeps me awake. The other thing that keeps me awake, you have hand of budgetary cuts, but what really touches me is the one on technology. Because we have held technology with the support of most of you, almost with our team, to see to it that we have e-filing, that Kenyans can file their documents in court from wherever they are, they do not have to travel to court. If you just have a device, you can file at the cyber cafe, you can file at the Uduma Center. We have also employed virtual courts. I think most of the cases, 50%, are now being done virtually, especially the civil cases, the mentions, the delivery of judgments and rulings, all the way to the prisons. Now, when you hear the ICT budget is cut to zero, our servers are getting old and tired because of too many cases being filed, and we cannot be able to renew those servers. That dear friends, keeps me awake at night. Now back to our top story. I want to take you live to the Kenya School of Government where the head of state is